Joe, even the story of Joe. God was basically saying, where were you when I got all this? God alone deserves the glory as the creator. So if we understand that the glory of God is the main theme of what God is doing, that's going to help us a whole lot because we're not going to see and look for salvation in every single passage we encounter. Okay? Yeah. So, yeah, makes sense. Makes sense. <laughs> so let's just review. I, I made an assertion. I said, um, I need to close my Facebook. If someone is messaging. Um, the, I started out by saying the main a big idea of God's plan or the Bible is the glory of God. And y'all have both agreed to that, right? Yes. Then we talked about how others have said that salvation is the main thing, right? Okay. And But then we went and we talked about fellowship within the Trinity, fellowship, service, and worship with the angels, fellowship in the garden, service, and worship even in the garden before the fall occurred. So in none of those situations was salvation occurring. Okay, mm -hmm. And so then we talked about the revelation of God, how God reveals himself, and as he reveals himself throughout time in his dealings with humanity, in his dealings with angels, in dealings with nations, in dealings with believers or unbelievers, um, carnal Christians, mature Christians, whatever, it reveals God as righteous, just, loving uh, merciful, gracious, all the attributes, right? And whenever we recognize that, he gets the glory. He is glorious in himself. His glory is everything that he is, okay? But we recognize that and we give him the glory when we say you are who you say you are. So what do 